What's up, YouTube? So, in this video, um, I'm going to be taking a look at the New York Guardians roster. They are another XFL team. Uh, I'm probably going to try to finish recording all these today and then edit them and release them whenever. I'll figure that out later. But I just want to finish this off so I don't have to worry about it. Um, first off, head coach and GM, which is a little weird. Kevin, uh, Kevin Gilbride, so... I don't really recognize any of these other coaches. Uh, honestly, so out of so far, what teams I've looked at, because uh, I have already looked at this roster. I usually don't do that, but I recorded this once and the audio didn't record, so I'm having to do it again. So obviously, I've seen this roster already. Um, yeah, they're really uh, unlike a lot of the other teams. There really wasn't very many players I recognize. Obviously, Matt McGloin, the quarterback that was assigned to them, he played for the Raiders. Uh, he struggled very much so. Um, he didn't get much playing time, but he was the quarterback when the Raiders made that large playoff run when they went thirteen to three, twelve and four. I forget what it was. Um, and. Derek Carr went down. Matt McGloin was the guy that had to come in for him, and he really struggled in the playoffs. So, yeah, keep that in mind. Uh, skill positions, DeMarcus Ayers is someone to look at. Keith Townbridge sounds familiar, but I can't place him. I don't recognize any of these other people. Maybe Marquise Williams at North Carolina. That sounds familiar. Uh... Holy, I don't even know how to say that. Finish. I'm going to call him Finish. Uh, I don't recognize any of these offensive linemen. Defensive front seven. Don't recognize any of them. Maybe TJ Barnes, but I don't know. Defensive backs. No. No. Um, open draft. Quadre Henderson at wide receiver. That that'll help a little bit. That'll help Matt McGloin. But outside of that, I don't really know any of these people. Wes Sutton sounds familiar, but I, I can't place him. But uh, anyway. I don't really have a whole lot else to say. Like I said, this roster really isn't full of people I know. And I knew that was going to be the case in the XFL, just like it was in the AAF. Hopefully some of these people make me remember their names. Looking forward to that. So, yeah. If you like this video, I would appreciate you hitting that like button. If you have any questions or comments, leave in the comments down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.